hello cancer <laughs> welcome to my channel guys feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading it is time stamped okay so if you click in the description bar below see where it says start reading click on that and uh, that will bring you to the uh, start of the reading this section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just going to take these in and I'll be back. So, Cancer, let's start your reading. All right, so. Um, and if I go quiet at any point, guys, just, you know, that's just me trying to verbalize what it is that I'm picking up. All right, so um, I feel strongly. Uh, so, okay, so let's start with you. We got the Emperor card. So there's de there's definitely something that you guys are. When we're talking about the Empress, we're talking about the birth and the creation of something. So this could represent uh, pregnancy. This could represent uh, children. This could represent even the relationship, just kind of the relationship, the birthing of this relationship, you know, moving it into something more committed uh, so to speak but there's definitely heaviness around this for you with that 10 card there there's um, a bit of a burden um, overwhelming feelings because of this person this person displays we've got the devil card there so there's a bit of possessiveness there uh, jealousy obsessiveness because there's an attachment that's been formed and it's really coming from a place of if, we, if I show you the cards here, we've got the, the Three of Swords, we've got the Five of Swords, and we've got the Two of Cups here. So there is definitely this fear around them not uh, losing this, not losing you, not losing what they've got with you. So that's where they're coming from. It's like every action that they take or the moves that they make is coming from that place of them not losing you. They're wanting to, uh, you know, remain emotionally connected. I'm not sure what... Or where they you know develop this idea of relationships or bonding or, or love but there is this attachment this fear around this so so you know that's where their actions are coming from that's where it's coming from but it's not making it easy for you though cancer you know in fact it's frustrating you with the five you're showing up as the five this frustration there understandable as well I mean this person can be extremely controlling when we're talking about the devil card we're talking about you know, real, you know, control, possessiveness, uh, jealousy as well. And you're just kind of, you know, irritated by it, which is causing you guys to, you know, causing there to be conflict when really what you're wanting to focus on is what you guys have established with that fall there, what you guys are, are building, where you guys are going. Because for the most part, you've got something here, you know, and you feel that you can actually have something with that king of pentacles you know you feel like if you know you can work through this then you can actually get to to the place that you want to with the, with this person but this person is being trapped by their emotions or their thoughts you know they, they, they're allowing their thoughts to run away they're allowing their thoughts to run away with them you know they're trapped they can't stop thinking about just all the all what could happen and all what, you know, it's all made up in their mind as well. It's, it's just what they're focusing on. All what could happen, what you possibly could be doing when you're walking, even coming from that angle and, you know, just tormenting their self with their thoughts, which is why they're creating that, which is why they're responding to you like that. Um... You're, you don't have any intentions to leave this. I mean, that's not what you really want it. You know, because again, like I said, you know, there's elements of this relationship 
that do it for you that is what you want it's just there's aspects of this person's character that is putting a damper on things or causing you to causing you guys to be in a bit of a rocky space i don't feel like they're aware uh, of the impact that it's having because we do have this judgment card there it's like yes we've got the four of swords which talks about processing thinking um but we do have that that judgment card there so it, there's judgment in terms of you know maybe why you're not choosing to be compliant uh, with what it is that they're wanting for example if you like to dress a certain way um, and they had met you like that then now all of a sudden they don't uh, they don't um, what's the word I'm looking for they don't uh, what's the word they don't fill the fill the blank in you guys know approve there we go they don't approve of it now because again it's coming from a place of losing you i want to pull on this person because you're you know yeah you're i mean how much how longer mm, go back from that so that, okay all right so let me just pull on this judgment card here because i feel like communication is going to have to take place with this person cancer you know, they don't see it. I don't feel like it's in their awareness of just how they're, they're you know, the, the, the impact that this is having on the relationship. Or even, I, I feel like, again, we've got the eight of swords there. Hangman, yeah. Feeling stuck, wanting to... is how do you deal with this thing communication bring it to the table express explain exactly what's going on here but i don't feel like you're at a point where you're looking to give this person any ultimatums because you're going to be you know you've decided that you you know you've, it's like you've decided on this person and you can work through it, it uh, depending on whether this person i mean you can't control someone's actions but it depends on whether this person can um see are self-aware enough of course after the conversation to make the steps to kind of look at why you know and, and, and deal with the fear of losing someone that they actually you know connect with and maybe it's coming from a place of having not had that, that type of connection before not sure what this person's upbringing is you know their attachment style um, plays a part in in this as well so maybe look at this person's childhood bring that up find out what happened there maybe they're an anxious attachment style or maybe they have an anxious attachment style uh, google that kind of look at the qualities and characteristics of, of those that establish that or inhabit that type of connection or attachment um, but yeah this person's obsessiveness jealousy is getting in the way um, so yeah Hopefully this has given you some form of clarity. For those of you who don't know, I do weekly singles and love readings. I will be implementing the uh, singles reading shortly, guys, so, so look out for that. Other than that, have a beautiful, beautiful day, and I shall see you next week. Bye. Ooh.